Hi guys, welcome back to Gwen's Fishing. Today we have 2017 Rod and Real Arsenal video. Let's get into it. This is my very first fishing rod. This is my Shakespeare Catch More Fish bait caster. I have that paired up with 20 pound braid and the lures I use on this one are jigs and chatter baits. I usually use this for my flipping and pitching rod. I have a black and blue jig on there with a missile baits D-bomb. This combo was $60 in all. Like I said this is my first combo I ever got. And yeah, it's a six foot medium heavy pole. This is actually the pole I caught my three pounder with. And hopefully I'll make more videos with that one. My next pole is an Abu, Abu Garcia Silver Max low profile with a Vigilante Abu Garcia pole. It's a six foot, six six medium heavy fast action rod it's carbon fiber so it's really really lightweight I usually I have it with 20 pound blue braid I usually throw swim baits and other kind of all different kinds of swim baits on here this is my second combo I bought my reel for sixty dollars at Cabela's and I bought the pole at Cabela's too for 30 it was on sale for 30 bucks but yeah I really like this reel I caught several fish with it it's very very fast 6 4 to 1 gear ratio yep so I'll get on to my next rod my next rod is a Shimano Sienna spinning rod. I have that paired up with 20 pound mono and that is on a Berkeley Elite 6 foot medium heavy fast action spinning rod. As you can see it says Berkeley right there. But this reel was $30 got it at Gander Mountain and I got this pole for Christmas 30 bucks at Gander Mountain I like the green and black camo on the back very very light rod can't wait to use it this spring and summer I w I'm going to use this for basically all soft plastics like from wacky rigs to net rigs and uh, drop shots my third pull, fourth pull, I mean, is my Shimono Crest Fire that has 20 pound braid on, or 25, 25 pound, 20 pound mono. Sorry about that, guys. Have this on a Wright and McGill seven foot rod. Use this basically for my. This is my cranking rod. I use all kinds of crankbaits on here. This is my. This is one of my crankbaits I use on it. Imitate a craw for spring. The rod it was seventy five bucks. The reel was eleven. Got it from my uncle. Right after Christmas. I haven't I haven't used that rod yet, but this summer I'm planning on using it quite a bit for the spawning bass, right on the beds and stuff, because I'll be up shallow. And my last setup is my Avi Garcia Black Max. This is my frog and rod. It's my frog and rod. I basically used all I use all different frogs on this. 
I have it paired up with 20 pound braid works really well for it and that is on a Ganner Mountain Vortex rod this is Vortex right there I got the real the real was fifty dollars it goes and I got the rod on sale for fifteen bucks at Ginner Mountain. It is a six six medium heavy rod and the uh, Wright and McGill one was a seven foot uh medium fast action rod. So good for cranking. But I I really like this reel. It's very, very sturdy and looks really, really sleek. The fro the frog I have on here is my field and stream, my river to sea, um, diver frog 60, got it in one of my mystery tackle boxes, and yeah, thank you guys for all for watching, um, our goal for this video is to get 20 subscribers, if you guys can do that and comment what other videos you want me to make, I'll make plenty, I'll make tons of videos. Cause this summer there's gonna be tons of fishing videos. Cause I go fishing with my friends and my family all the time. So thank you guys for watching. Please like and share and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.